Hey, uh, this uh, this Apple break was brought to you by Your Name Could Be Here or Way Over There. You know what I mean? Think about it. Poof. Man, I was so indecisive on the Apple because I know I don't want one right now, but I may want one really soon. So I brought it with me just in case. So... I got my Apple. It's another fucking enormous beast of an Apple. Look at the size. It's like a fucking softball. I'm about to eat this motherfucker. But when I'm ready, I'll eat it like in case of an emergency. When I have low health, you know, and I'm like energized. It's a life gem. Exactly. You get it. What kind of Apple? It's my last Cosmic Crisp. I brought it on the last break. It's washed and ready to go. It's big. This is a big fucking apple. Look at the size of this thing. It's like a like a baseball or a big uh, softball. <clears throat> Thanks, BNZO and Honey Man. All right, I'm going in. Yo! Have you tried jalapeno cream cheese? What? What'd you say? This apple is loud. Can't hear you. Mmm. Thanks, Breakin. Half? You tried jalapeno cream cheese? Yeah, of course I have. It's good. Yeah, I like green apples, but I think that they have the toughest skin. And I get sick of the skin before I'm done with them. But if they're peeled, like let's say you're a punk kid who doesn't appreciate their mom. And your mom peels the apple for you. Then they're good. But I'm an adult. Baked apples? What the fuck? Good shit snitching on yourself, fatso. <laughs> yeah, Baked you. apples? What do you mean, like a pie? Have any of you tried grilled watermelon? I heard about it. I'm intrigued, but I've never done it. And I've never tried it. But I've heard about it. I heard it's pretty good. I heard it has an interesting Thank texture you. and flavor. <laughs> Thank you. I, I've tried... It reminds me of grilled cactus. The idea of it. But I didn't like grilled cactus. Chocolate color. Tell me, there. what are you doing, my friend? Shut up. Don't tell me how to drive. We'll be right back after this. Thanks, Kenny, and Tuxedo Pizza, and D Evolver, and Crimson Chimera. Um, thanks. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Hey, what kind of sponsors do you think I should look for for my Apple breaks? Like, I'll just take a break, and then I'll, like, pull out an Apple, and then I'll, like, click on one of these things, you know? <laughs> Thank you. I'll go like this, and then, like... I'll have something set up like this, but it will be something else, like something that says corn nuts. And then I'll be like, all right, time for the corn nuts break. And I'll put the corn nuts logo there. So, uh, what are you guys eating? Know what I mean? Mm. Put 
Play the MLG song. <laughs> Thank I can't you. remember. Oh, I think I remember something about that, but I don't remember what the song is. I remember the Evo song. Yeah, I like pears a lot, but pears are like peaches and mangoes. They have a lot of RNG. You can't just fucking look at a pear and be like, is that going to be a good pear? You can't tell. But apples, you can pretty much fucking guarantee that shit. You can look at an apple and taste the apple. But pears are random as fuck, just like peaches. And mangoes are that way too. Uh, so I don't really love that. I don't like, uh, you know, I like luck, but I don't like to, uh, randomize fruit. Nah. Because it's so disappointing. Mangoes are a true 50-50 mix-up? Dude, I know, man. There's so many failure points in a mango. It's insane. It could be too sweet. It could be not sweet enough. Or it could be this like weird texture where it's like grainy or it could be so slimy that it's like an avocado. They're just like really random as fuck, man. There's so many things that could happen with a mango. But the fucked up thing is a perfect mango, dude, it might as well be the best fruit there is. And I feel that way about peach and I feel that way about uh, yes. pears as well. The you perfect one, sports. it blows your mind. When it's the perfect one. Uh, you may not have experienced like perfect fruit, but I have before. And when you do, it changes fr fruit forever. It ruins fruit. Plum can be good too. You're right. Pomegranate? No. Pomegranate is an excellent flavor, but it's a fucking shitty ass fruit. I love pomegranate flavor. Like other things made out of pomegranate, maybe even jam. But the fruit itself, that's got to be the dumbest fruit ever. Hell no. This is way too much work. It gets everywhere. Everything turns red like crazy. It's not worth it. I've had a, a relative of mine has a pomegranate tree that makes... How about pomegranate juice? Is that what you're talking about? You can't be talking about pomegranates straight up. Who the fuck has all day to be dealing with that shit? That would like... Imagine getting like elote from the Mexican lady... And eating it one kernel at, at a time. Corn. One kernel of corn at a time. Except half of each kernel is a seed. That's what you are saying is fucking good. It's top. Top tier fruit. One kernel of corn. One at a time. And it's going to turn out your fingers red for days. Come on, man. Pomegranate juice, on the other hand... Amazing. Antioxidants. Very refreshing. But really sweet. Mm. But as a fruit, fuck no, dude. Hell no. <laughs> Thank you. Mm. There's a lot of fruit talk going on in here. Yeah, I like all, all berries except blueberries. I think blueberries are really good when they're in stuff like a muffin or a jam or something like that. But if you eat a blueberry just like that in your mouth fresh, I think they suck. Yeah, in a pancake they're good, in a muffin they're good. But I've never had a blueberry that actually tastes as sweet as I want it to taste. Really sweet. I don't think so. I think they're just mild by nature. You have to cook them to get the sweetness out of them. I 
I've never had a dragon fruit. I know what they look like though. They are like, they're white with spots. I just ate an apple. Thanks. Hey, good shit. Apples are really good for you. Dragon fruit tastes like a sad kiwi. Hmm. Mm. Kiwis are a little bit too slimy for me, but they're all right. They can be good. I like kiwis on like a... Well, now I'm starting to sound like that guy who was baking his apples, but I like them on like a... What do you call that thing that has fruits on it with a crust? A tart? Yeah, a tart. I like that. A kiwi, like one kiwi, maybe like half of a kiwi sliced, cover it in that slime, then maybe, if it's sitting next to a strawberry and some other dope shit. But a whole fucking kiwi straight up, no slime, fuzzy and all that shit? Nah, fuck that. Kiwis are the best fruit for vitamin C. Are you aware that your body isn't really able to intake more than a certain amount of vitamin C? And you can achieve that is like really easily. So there's no such thing as like this fruit is really good for vitamin C. There's a very small amount that your body can even use at a time. So it's probably like a myth what you're saying. Like, basically what I'm saying is any kind of fruit that has vitamin C is going to give you as much as you can use all in one nut anyway. Thanks. Put the mic closer to your mouth. Close? I don't want you guys to hear me chewing. Man, this was a great idea. Apple breaks. Purple or green grapes. I like grapes a lot, but due to the delivery nature of the fruit, I have a tendency to overdo it, and they have very low nutritional value. I'll fucking sit there and eat like a Greek... Fucking, uh, fucking, whatever you call it, Caesar, Julius Caesar, I'll eat the whole thing, the whole fucking, one at a time, feeding myself grapes like a beautiful woman, you know, mm, they're good, and you'll just fucking eat them all, one bite at a time, so, and they have no nutritional value, very little, it's all sugar, especially if you're gonna eat <laughs> the whole you. fucking thing. Damn, I'm done with my apple already. Get an apple sponsorship? Yeah, that's the idea. Except not an apple sponsorship, but some other kind of sponsorship. You know? What's a cool thing to get sponsored by? Get sponsored by Dutch Masters? <laughs> that's a funny idea. <laughs> this is the Dutch Masters. Apple break. Oh, speaking of which, I think I got like an offer for some kind of baldness shit. Which is weird, because I mean, that doesn't make sense. Who the fuck's gonna buy baldness medicine from a bald guy? That doesn't make any sense. It's like uh, hiring me as a personal trainer. You know? Like, yeah, man, I'll hook you up. You wanna have pecs like these? Yeah, they fill you up for a little while. It's a great snack. I'm a huge fan of apples in general. And I'm a really huge fan of having nice, smooth BMs. 
There's nothing worse than being constipated. That's got to be the worst thing on earth. Almost. It's up there. You can't, like, you know, there's no solution. You have to just, like, wait it out and drink a shitload of water. It's not like where you can lay down or you could sit or you could fucking nothing. Man. You're S-L-A-O-L. -L. God, this guy has stupid magical stupid... What the fuck was that? That guy? Did you see that? It was a fucking skeleton. Oh yeah, rate, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you think about- I just took an apple break. What's up, just got here, you missed it. You could have already been jacking off. In the comments below. Don't forget to ring the notification bell, amigos. And subscribe, we put out videos every day. With that being said, let's get right into it.